Well, we want to continue with the second part of our series with former Major League pitcher Tom Masney of the Pennant Group. Hey, Tom. Neil, how are you? Great. Uh, I'm Neil Gordon with Augusta Business Daily. And because Tom's uh, previous life was so heavily involved at Progressive Field and at baseball stadiums, we thought we would use an analogy, if you will, a correlation of StubHub as it relates to how baseball works now, and then also how that correlates um, to employee benefits. Why don't we start with why people are using StubHub now? Yeah, so, you know, why StubHub, why Kayak, right? Um, How people are purchasing, um, you know, tickets um, has really changed, and it's a changing in employee benefits and how we access care, um, where we go, why we go, and what we're getting out of it. You know, so we look at StubHub and, you know, StubHub, there's a, a many different ways of getting tickets to events, but StubHub is very widely known mm-hmm. and, and people go to it for a number of different reasons, but really it's, it's price, outcomes, and options. And convenience too, right? Right, it is. It makes it, it easy, but mm-hmm. it's it's really about, you know, we know what our price is. We know what we're willing to pay. Um, we know options, where we sit, why we sit there. And then we know what our outcomes are because if we sit here, we'll get this result. We also are sometimes willing to overpay mm-hmm. for a, a particular ticket because we know that that outcome that we'll get will be a more desirable outcome. And that is starting to correlate into employee benefits. We have technology now that allows you to see what the cost of procedures are before you get that that procedure. Mm -hmm. We also know that some doctors are not as highly rated as other physicians. So why would I go to one physician if my outcome won't be as good as going to another? And sometimes that physician or that facility might cost a little bit more money, but my outcome is going going to be better and my chance of reoccurrence or having to have a secondary follow-up procedure is going to be less by going to um, the higher-priced option. Makes sense. And uh, Tom Masty is the CEO of the Pennant Group, and although you can't buy a pair of tickets to the doctor's office at thepennantgroup.com, he does have lots of great information to try to help you. And do you feel your industry is, in fact, um, going more and more to technology and transparency, and what do you think the future looks like? Yeah, it is. It has to. Everything um, in our world is going that direction. Um, there's been legislation that's been passed down um, and being proposed that is requiring that. You know, full transparency. You know, we're trying to um, get hospitals to put out what every procedure charges um, and is charged for so that you know going into it what your cost is going to be. Um, And I think that's huge. Um, Let's let's correlate it to going to the grocery store. Mm -hmm. All right, so if I go to the grocery store and I'm checking out and I I buy all these items, I got a cart full of items and I go up and I start scanning everything and scanning everything. And I know how much money that I can spend and I'm willing to spend and I think I know how much this costs. But at the end of it, I go to check out and give them my credit card and the, um, the checkout person goes, well, we'll send you an invoice. We'll send you a bill in 30 days, and that'll tell you how much we owe, you owe. Surprise! Yeah. <laughs> Unfortunately, that's how our, our world works. That's how the medical community operates, and technology and legislation is trying to change that. And I think that's huge for our market and our industry, and we have to evolve. Um, employees have to evolve. Employers have to evolve, and consultants have to evolve with them to stay on top of that so they know what uh, products to put in place to help them achieve their desired outcomes. And specifically, if an employer has an idea of what a procedure may cost for an employee, will that impact what you suggest the plan an employer chooses? Meaning, I know they can share the benefit cost with employees, but but there's other ways that they can actually pay medical oh, bills. Is a- that right? Absolutely. Absolutely. I mean, there's there's a uh, multitude of different options out there. Um, you know, I think first and foremost is getting data. Data is key. 
and what one company implements from a, a plan perspective may be completely different than what another company does. But it's based off of the conditions in the group and the costs that are driving um, the premiums. And until we know that information, we can't make recommendations of what we put in. We're just kind of throwing darts and hoping something sticks. Um, you know, but from a consumer standpoint, you know, cash is king. You know, uh, everywhere you go, you can pay cash, and that might be the cheapest option for you. Um, you know, I know physicians, physician practices, doctors, um, uh, practices, hospitals, they'll take cash because they're looking for cash flow. And instant cash flow means that they can pay bills a lot easier, um, and they'll give you a discount for it. So, you know, I'm not saying that is the end-all, be-all way of doing this, but for certain employees, for certain groups, that might be the route to go. Yeah. Do you do you ever have these StubHub-like conversations with any of your clients or people that you're just trying to introduce uh, your trustworthy service to? Absolutely. You know, there's there's a concept that's going through our community. Um, it's going across the country, and it's direct primary care. Mm. And it's basically providers and physicians are fed up with the system also. Um, and they're looking for better quality life um, and to truly get into medicine and get back to the reason that they got into medicine, and that is to service their patients. Um, so direct primary care is in our community today um, and is continuing to grow, and that is an avenue that a lot of employers are starting to look at. Our ultimate goal in, with my agency is to offer a product that is a direct-to-employer relationship that puts the power back into the employers so they can make educated decisions on where they get their health care and where they're spending their money. And it's happening in every other service industry. Why not? Why not? Yours? Why not benefits? Absolutely. Well, to learn more about Tom services and really to sit down and um, have a chat with him, a consultation, uh, please go to the pennant group.com, the pennant group.com. He and his wife have relocated here to Augusta. Their office is in West Augusta. Again, the And uh, we're so thankful for the folks at Get Up Productions and uh, the studio that they provide. And again, uh, all of the information is up on the screen if you'd like to take a look at some other podcasts. And uh, Tom's podcasts are all also chronicled at AugustaBusinessDaily.com.